Hello everybody and welcome back to Promise Gaming and more EU4 Cradle of Civilization playing as Revolutionary Room. Currently fighting Yao and Funj, this shouldn't be too hard. I'm mostly killing them because they're some of the only Sunni in the area for me to kill. And we're kind of in this weird position where I don't think there's anywhere else I'm able to expand, really. Can't fight Transoxiana, don't want to take over India, most of it's Hindu and have to convert all of it. Can't fight Mali at the moment. Um... I guess I could take over Madagascar or parts of Indonesia, but... Eh? Maybe kill the Mamluks finally, put them out of their misery. I don't know. There's there's not a whole lot that I'm able to do if I don't want to go to the New World. Which is awkward, because I'm trying really hard to finish this stupid Unify Islam thing. Honestly, this Unify Islam mission, like... <laughs> I'm only doing it for theme reasons, I'll just repeat it. I'm only doing it for thematic reasons. It's not actually that important. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm hindering myself. I'm handicapping myself trying to do this. Uh, and California is now independent of the Mamluks. Good for them. So I feel like the only thing that I'm able to do if I want to continue expanding is try to feed some client states. I do have another relationship limit or slot. I could take on the Commonwealth and start feeding off some land to a client state just for fun. With the anticipation that eventually I'll be able to annex them and that's one way of continuing to expand. That's, that's an option, certainly. Uh, Multan, I would love to kill if they weren't guaranteed by so many people for some reason. I really don't know why they're all doing that, but... Oh well. Um, let's see if we can catch these guys. They're trying to kill all my little buds. I don't like that. Okay, so we got Borno, good. Uh, split, split, and split. Go here, 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 and here. Uh, we probably could carpet siege them all the way, but... Oh well. Yeah, I, I don't know. Unify Islam, man. It's um, it's annoying. Having to convert that many provinces is really, really irritating. It would have been easier, actually, if we had stay, uh, decided to go for Persia instead of his room. Because I think that they actually were going to have some extra missionary strength tied into them, which is pretty decent. But obviously we're not going to get that. Alright, go here, 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 and here. At this point, you might actually be willing to give up. So let's see. I want to take all your land... I probably can even take all the Funj from you as well, so let's just do this all in one piece deal. The answer right now is no. Would result in annexation, length of war, current peace offer, military strength. We need to shatter your military before you're going to be willing to give up. I may need to do a force march. Okay, a truce of Portugal has ended. That's not too bad. Um, where are you going? Going north. Makes sense. Let's see if we can catch this guy. Nepal's dead. Okay. Raya's hands converted. Good. I mean, we are making pretty good progress, all in all. We are definitely uh, converting at a rapid pace. I like that. Okay, and they're dead. There we go. Mamlux is dying to Ainu? Really? Fascinating. Uh, I think that's all we need to finish this war, so let's just take all this land. Um, I'll take your money. Do I have any overextension at the moment? Answer is no. Good enough for me. Doink. Okay, that fills in another desert, makes us look a lot better. <laughs> if I could just fill in these holes, I'd feel nice about it. You know what I'm going to end up doing? Is uh, once I decide to get rid of religious ideas, and I think I will do that, because I'm only doing this to get the Unify Islam, I don't want to get stuck with this for the rest of the game. Our unrest is pretty good right now. So what I think I'm going to do is, once I get rid of religious ideas, I'll pick up exploration ideas very temporarily, just to fill in like these four uh, holes in the desert, just to make the map look better. Then I'll get rid of it. Again, is it really important? No. But at this point, we're so powerful, I don't really have to worry about what's the optimal play. I can just do whatever I think is fun. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. Alright. So these guys are all done. Uh, we need to kill them. You guys need to go and join them. Somehow. They're mostly cannons. I'm a little concerned about that, actually. Why don't you go here instead? The natives might rise up and murder them all. Okay, so if that's done, uh, I should have a lot of troops in position getting ready to fight to the Commonwealth. We'll probably declare on Wallachia. Um, they are guaranteed by the Commonwealth, so this way I don't have to fight France. And that'd be an easy way to fight them. Take a little bit of land, feed a client state. Hello, Papal State with 54,000 troops that are on low morale. You'd be easy to murder! Oh, that is sorely tempting. I actually kind of want to do that now. I wouldn't mind declaring a jihad to take over um, Rome. I really wouldn't. That'd be kind of fun. 
These troops can go and intercept you. I don't know where you're going. Nope, you're going through Molly. You're heading this way. Let's go this way. Try to intercept them on the way. 95 Republican tradition right now is pretty good. <clears throat> uh, oh, hello. Well, they're dead. Forgot there was another army sitting over there. You can core that now. And that's that. All right. Looking pretty solid, honestly. Uh, we could go for another election. I think we might as well. We have plenty of Republican tradition. This guy is 51 years old. He'll last a bit longer. So now he is going to be a 644 Grand Vizier. Trade efficiency, spy network. I think I want to go for... Well, I don't really want to go for the um, Diplo Rep if he's the wrong culture. I'm going to get rid of a couple of these spy network guys, see if I can get something better. It's just not good enough. Um, improve relations. Eh. All right. It's not that good, but we'll go with it. I don't have any estates anymore, so I can't go for, like, uh, the diplomats from the emirs or anything like that anymore. It's not an option. Syracuse has been converted. We'll go for Palermo. Uh, I am trying to improve relations with my little client states down here. I guess we could try to fight Portugal. Now, if we did that, we'd have to fight Spain and the Papal State again. Spain's allied to La Plata, Austria. They're allied to quite a few people. Fighting them sounds unpleasant. And the Papal State, of course, are allied to a lot more as well. Still, if I actually... Well, their independence is guaranteed by France, so I can't really co belligerize them. Hmm. I think we'll stick with the original plan and try to kill the Commonwealth. I don't think it's going to be too hard to do that. The other thing I could do... Well, I want to regenerate some manpower. We could start building out more armies. I do have plenty more force limit. And I think we actually have enough supply limit that I can really start doubling up these armies. Get some real big stacks. Will I have more on trade the income? No. Where is Mombasa? It is Ethiopia. What about Mogadishu? Also Ethiopia. I don't want to fight Ethiopia, so all these missions are worthless to me. And I can't rely more on trade income. It's not that easy to manipulate the thing anymore. Okay, uh, let's get these troops in position. We're going to kill them pretty quickly. Um, excellent vintage, national unrest, and mysticism. Wait, I thought we weren't supposed to have why. Oh, wait, we're not legalistic. We're mysticism. Okay, never mind. I guess it makes some sense. Sweet, a tiny bit more missionary strength. Tiny little bit. Our colony has declared war on somebody. Hey, good. I'm glad you guys are taking some initiative. I probably should help with that, actually. You, for example, you're allied to Charka. Really? You had to be allied to this guy here? Okay. Who else is easy? Cusco? Cusco has no friends. I don't see any reason why we can't just go kill Cusco real quick. Just start feeding these guys to all my vassals. Colonial nations. It'd be easy enough, right? New advisor. Um, I still want... I wanted. To, I liked that missionary. Fire them, fire them, fire them. Fire them. See what we get if we re-roll. Although, real quick, let's just go ahead and declare a revolution war. Oh, I'll get legalism. That sucks. Revolution! Uh, I miss imperialism. It was so good, though. You know? Imperialism... I lost another advisor. Holy crap, how are they all just popping over dead? Missionary strength. Buff him. Buff him. Buff him. Advisors. Uh, land force and modifier doesn't sound that good. Maintenance modifier saves money. Morale of armies sounds good. Discipline sounds good. Let's go for the morale of armies guy. Promote, promote. And this should be easy. You're dead. Goodbye. New conversion. Orthodox and Vladimir. And our troops are in position and ready to murder the Commonwealth. So, we need a diplomat. To declare the new war, I do not want to co belligerize because I'm not in the mood to fight France. So this is going to have to be good enough for now. What about Wurttemberg? Hello, you're actually pretty large. You're allied to Bohemia and Wallachia. Hmm. There's nothing I can really do with you, so co belligerizing you doesn't do much. All right. Um, revolution? Yeah. How about this? I, I, I raise my hands and cast a spell of greater imperialism! That sort of works, right? Yeah. Where are you going? You're going this way? No, you're not. You're locked. You're doomed. All right. Go to the capital. Hi, Commonwealth. We're fighting you now. 
Um, you have forts pretty deep, actually. Scares me a little bit, but alright. Let's see. Take you as a general. You've got a general. Just reassign these guys. I want to make sure that we have it all correct. You're good. You're good. You've got a general. Okay. This all looks right. So I want you to push this far. You go here. You guys go here, here. Let's actually push all the way up here instead. Seems reasonable enough. All right, Wallachia shouldn't last long. And they're dead. All right, defensive planner and all that, good. Uh, let's go here. Can I get to this? If I go all the way around, sure. Not in the mood. Just worry about these forts. Are they level eight? Oh gosh, it is a level eight fort. It's so annoying. All right, Commonwealth has some troops moving. That's fine. More heretics have been converted. Keep working. We really seem to have lost a lot of progress here. Why? Divine Supremacy. What's Divine Supremacy? I don't know. Mysticism. Oh! I lost so much mysticism. That's why. Ah, So annoying! Okay. Just work on these forts. Let's push up this way. See what we can do. Siege of Juan Campo or whatever is over. Nice. Take this. Take the money. Nothing else matters. Goodbye. And that should go automatically to Rumi Peru. Good. Hi, Charka. Keto. Can't really help with this one. Don't want to fight Haiti. Um... Your ally to Spanish Peru. This would be an excuse to finish them off and take the rest of this land. That seems reasonable enough. Yeah, we'll kill these guys next. And Spanish Peru is allied to... They are a colony of Spain. Wait a minute. If I declare this war, Spanish Peru may be allied, but they are still a colony, which means I think I'd have to fight Spain. So maybe I don't want to do that at the moment. All right, I guess we'll hold off on that. Charka, what about you? La Plata. Not in the mood to fight them either. Gosh, we're just getting stymied everywhere right now. All right, hi guys. How you doing? Um, what's your tech level? 26 to my 27. You got reinforcements on the way too. How about this? I'll kill these guys if they lock. Nope, wait. You're joining them up. Right? Yes. Okay, I don't want to. I don't want to fight that. That's a little bit too strong right now. Let's just keep the armies close together. Keep sieging down the forts. There goes one. Moving on to the next. You guys go to Wilno. Good where you are. They're already on low war enthusiasm because they lost their capital. That's to be expected. Hello. All right. So if you're gonna lose some of your army, then this is easy for me to just sneak attack. Faction takeover once again. What's driving? War is driving the fact that these guys keep getting influence. And our, our high army tradition. I really could just leave it as is for now. I don't need the unrest, right? No, rebels are more or less under control. Let's just let these guys have fun for a bit. Alright, so if you want to move your troops out of here, I'll kill you real quick. No? Alright, you're going to make me get reinforcements, huh? Okay, um, states. We could do that. Oh, hi, Wurttemberg. Let's see. I'm okay with fighting these guys in the hills. We have a numbers advantage, and that looks pretty effective. Sure, we can do that. Wasn't a stack wipe, but it reduced them quite a bit. The Commonwealth wanted to help, but then saw that that was a losing fight. And gave up. The cowards that they are. Oh, hi. Okay, they backed up with some armies, huh? Let's grab a couple of these forts, and then we'll go back and start swinging behind to kill them. We'll do this. A little worried about this army being trapped back here, but at least we got a wall breach. New mission? Gosh dang it! It really wants me to get a foothold. It really, really does. Alright, you're not going to be able to retreat. We're going to stop you here. I think he's going to be in trouble here, actually, with three armies bearing down on him. Let's try canceling the mission and reset this once again. 
This stuff got sieged down by Wallachia, apparently. Okay, he is retreating some of his armies. I think I might be able to win this fight. Depending on how many more reinforcements he throws in at me. I'll have to take a river crossing, I think. And there's no defensive terrain bonus for me. So it actually would be a pretty tough fight. I could send ten more cannons. Gosh, the splitting detach mechanics are so dumb. Alright. Uh, let's see if we can catch these guys in Tambov. The answer is yes. We should be able to stack wipe these guys. Siege of Wilno! Good. Time to back up. I think these guys are a little overextended. Squish! Stack wipe! Okay. Let's have you guys go here, then here, then here. Split up a little bit. Okay. Where are you going to go? I'm going to double up on this fort. Use my uh, Napoleonic Warfare bonus to try and squish him. Get that fort bonus. You guys go here. Help him out. You guys cut them off from reinforcements. I think this is a fight we should be able to win. Let's get a uh, force march in here so I can make this faster. Religious uproar. Gosh dang it. Get Muslim mass infantry in Adan. Decided to go for the mysticism instead. Force march, join. They retreated. Okay. Chase them down. Probably going here. Reinforce. Travel in stock stacks of two. Two by two. Hands of blue. Firefly reference. All right. Got the fort. Nice. Now we should be able to go kill these guys. Of course, they're going to get the fort too. You're going north? Is that allowed? That's fine. I can kill you here. This should be a stack wipe. It is. Good. Okay. So they're split up, which means we should be able to start routing them now. Uh, hi. Found you. Nope. You're not going past me. And I think we actually did catch the army here. Maybe? Truce of Spain has ended. Good, we can do more damage to them if we feel like it. Need to create a new state. Um, Kasser Ibram. This one was going to be a little tough to convert. So let's go ahead and turn this into a state. It's actually got pretty reasonable development anyway. So let's do this. We'll turn you into a quick state. I could uh, adopt your culture now, I think. Maybe? Yes, 2%. It's not a lot, um, but we'll do it anyway. And the reason we're going to do that is it should make it a lot easier for me to convert them, and if I want to pass the Edict, I now can. Okay, so you guys are marching around trying to get some reinforcements. There goes Tirgovesti. Finish off Wallachia. Go down to Greece, since they seem to be interested in sticking themselves in a corner where they can't escape from me. All right, uh, another fort down over here. Good. Um, let's start moving toward their capital, I think. Um, in fact, yeah, let's just go straight to Warsaw. You have one siege, you have two. So I'll let you take the siege. You provide support. You catch them in Bessarabia. Let's kill some more men. I think you're going to be okay at 78%. You should be able to get out of there if you have any problems. More cores are done. Good. Whoop. You know, lost you there, buddy. Come back here. I love you. We are friends. You are dead. I grieve for you. Okay. So these guys are marching out of the way. Uh, we have another 27 stack sitting over there. Um, I'm going to go ahead and take this army to go and deal with them. This gun should be fine on its own. Let's see. I'm going to go ahead and push through Austria, I think. Let's head toward another fort. 49% on Warsaw. Of course it didn't win. Three mercantilism. 300 free diplo power. I'll take it. Vladimir has been converted. We're making pretty good progress. I can't scroll down anymore, so... That's good. Uh, revolutionary... Sorry, strengthen the government? Sure, why not? Let's get some more uh, Republican tradition. Okay, good. And that's Bessarabia. And we'll go to Crimea. New mission, conquer Bali. There's a mission I can get behind. In Brunei. Uh, sure. Not sure when I'm going to do that, but it is a mission I can take. New states. East Adriatic. Could do that. Where do I need to do some more conversions, though? 
I got a lot of Coptic land, actually. I could make this into a state. It's not got a lot of development, though. This does, though. I already made this into a state. Never mind. Um... Some of the land... This is getting sieged down, apparently. I didn't even realize I had enemies over here. Uh, we could do a state there. Um... Actually, I don't think states anywhere else really do a lot for me. So, yeah, I guess we can do the East Adriatic. East Adriatic, which should be right here. Okay, court. Done. Wow, that was nothing. Oh, right. We had coder, which means that a lot of that stuff is already automatically cored. Let's go to Plock, apply some more pressure. They are starting to swarm a little. He is trying to run from me, which is unnecessary. Okay, I want you to lock here. Go to Ryazan. Thank you, dummy. All right, uh, so if that's done, good, 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 good. Um, we already killed all of them, so let's move up here. There goes the Siege of Warsaw. We want, lost the Siege of Smolensk, so that's a fort we need to get back, but we should be able to crush these troops. Um, how are we doing on army professionalism? We are not quite at 100. I could fix that, but I think I'd rather get the 15 army tradition. 98 right now. Which is pretty good. Let's see if this army can get to Smolensk. Keep converting the Copts. So if this is done, let's move up here. I want to kill that 31 stack. Can I handle that? Oh, no, 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 no. Not if you're going to have 27,000 reinforcements. Maybe when he, once he gets locked. No, he's still got another 18. I don't want to take that fight. That's too much. I can make one more state. Sicily it is. We will core you. Thank you. Okay. Uh, tariffs on naval supplies? No. There goes the Siege of Krim, or Crimea. So we could probably peace out now, actually. Probably. Um, if I wanted to peace out with Wallachia, and full annex you, you would not accept. Because you really don't want to. But I would like to take a lot of this land and hand it over to a client state. So I guess we'll just sit back and get some more war score. Ming has declared imperialism against Russia. That's scary. An expansive Ming is always upsetting. Okay, he realizes that he's about to get surrounded, so he's, he's freaking out. Let's go that way. New Albion. Really? That's what you named your colonial nation? Ooh, I like that. I think I did that once. New Albion. Huh. That's a cool name. I dig it. All right, they're trying to siege all this stuff down, which is annoying, but I don't really care. Uh, could try to knock Württemberg out of the war, but, uh, meh. Not sure I care enough. We got some Alance Basque. Um, we could go here. Keep going this way. Let's see if we can trap him. He's got 51,000 sitting up here. So let's try to trap that. Mercenary maintenance reduction. Don't care. Not useful. I think we're going to stack wipe that, and we did. Where are you going? Tambov, you're probably going for this fort. Let's back off. I see him coming after me. He's force marching, which is always scary. Means he's charging at me, screaming at the top of his lungs like a madman. Okay, he's actually going down here now. Nope, he can't decide what he wants. Playing the courts. Mysticism. Converted perm. Good. Minus 39 piety at the moment. One more fort would be great. Maxed out relations there. Can't do any more states. Uh, so, we'll do a quick development or two. Let's see. Guess we'll go to this fort, go to this fort, go to this fort. We'll tempt him to spread out. You guys are going to go down here. You guys are going to go down here. See your army, and I want it. Okay, capped out on military power. Um, this time I'm not sure if it makes a lot of sense. I guess we could do one more strength in government, but any more than this, and I don't think it's worth it. All right. So, Lucky, how you feel now? Pretty good. Pretty good, it turns out. Um, so I need to occupy this if I want to hand it off. So let's wait until we get some troops in position. City of Medina. 
sure, I'll lose some taxes. I don't care about money. I've got 76,000 ducats and no idea what to do with it. And that's another siege done. And another one. That was easy. Let's kill these guys. And there's another one. Oh my gosh. Artillery combat ability. Yeah, you didn't bother upgrading some of these forts, did ya? No, sir, you did not. All right. We are going to... You're going up here. Crush. Okay. That should be a stack wipe. No, not a stack wipe. All right, but you're pretty weak. So let's grab this. Let's grab this. We'll just uh, make a giant client state, basically. You can split, go here. Split, go here. This should be enough for whatever I want to do, right? I think so. And I certainly assume that this is not going to come back to bite me and I need to convert all of my uh, client state's lands before I can unify Islam. I'm assuming that much. I really hope it's true. All right, we're going to full annex you. We're going to take this land. And all of this as well. 64% overextension is meh. I'd like to get a little bit more. We're losing some land here in Wallachia, but I think we're going to be okay. The trial. Uh, I'll gain the Republican tradition. Sure, why not? You go here to Cherson. And once we siege that down, we can get even more land off to a client state. Okay. Good. Take all of that, plus these now. That's a reasonably good size, right? I think so. Now, I could separate peace out with the Commonwealth, but we didn't co them, so I think it's going to be a lot harder to do that. Let's just see, though. Yeah, can't do that. Alright, we're just going to peace out with Wallachia. I will take all of this. Thank you, you are very generous. And I'm not going to have to core any of it. Probably. Alright, so that's done. Uh, what area do we want to call this? Region? Carpathia. Or Carpathia. Perfect name, I like it. We're going to do that. You are my new client state. You'll be a republic. I will make you of a purplish color, because that's the color I remember you being in Rome Total War. And you can be a perfectly white flag. Yes! It's a little boring, but it'll work. We'll do it. Okay. This goes to the client state. Client state. Oop. We can't be at war with you anymore. Go away. Hey! Oh, we have Wallachian separatists. Ah. I was going to say, we're not at war with Württemberg anymore. Stop it! That's true, we're not. Um, in the meantime, we'll send this off to Carpathia. This goes to Carpathia. Right? Yes, it's not Bessarabia anymore. It's been renamed. Got confused for a split second there. Doop, 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 Okay, so that's all done. We have a new client state who should do some conversions for me. Loyal subjects. Sweet! Wish I could use that in five years. Maybe we can finish converting people and I can start annexing them. I don't know. We're so close to being done, actually. Really close to being done. Come on, missionaries. You can do this. Truceth Molly has ended. Oh, good. Another person I can kill. Convert them. Spain has finally embraced the Enlightenment. Another one. Spain is a world power again. Okay. Did I miss you? This goes to Carpathia, and we are capped out on power. How are we doing on tech? Still 10 years ahead of time, and look how many monarch points I've got. I don't know what to do with all of it. It's pretty cool, though. All right, so that's our new vassal. Still need to annex Rumi Horn. These guys, I could kill Portugal, but that means fighting Spain. Could kill Mali. They are allied only to Sus, who I want to kill as well. So we could co them and finish it off. I don't have a truce with them anymore, so yes. That will be the next target, probably as of next week, because we're about out of time. Next video, I think we're going to be able to unify Islam. So that's uh, top priority. And after that's done, the floodgates are open. Yeah, let's go ahead and spend that. Uh, and we can... Ooh, look how... Oh, oh I want... Alright, is it worth losing 25 mysticism? Answer's yes. I think I get a lot more missionary strength by doing this. So let's go ahead and do that. 
yeah, um, after, after we have finished unifying Islam, I'm gonna get rid of the religious ideas, and I think at that point the floodgates have opened, and we can declare jihad on pretty much all of Europe. I think that would be nice. I could take over Russia. I can really start blobbing like crazy. Again, I normally would blob a lot more than this, but... Just because this stupid goal that I made for myself... Debatably not the best of choices. Uh, I'm kind of limited in what I can do. 80,000 ducats! I'll probably spend this in between videos, but I'm not really sure what to do when I'm making 400 ducats a month. So, let me know. Thank you all for watching, hope you enjoyed. If so, then be sure to hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.